my name's Daniel, I work in Pall Mall Barbers in Trafalgar Square in London. And today I'm going to show you how to get Gary Barber's look. The main thing you need to ask for is ask for a number, number sort of two, maybe one and a half if you like a really short sharp cut on the back and sides, going pretty high. Okay. The top of the hair needs to be cut really neutral and then so by, by neutral, not longer on any side, just even all the way through. And then what you need to do is ask your barber to cut a little bit of texture into the hair. Okay. With a texture, do it from this part going going back. Okay. Don't really put too much texture into the front. You want a little bit more length in the front so you can sweep that back a little bit. Okay. Now to style the hair, you want to be using something like Pow Mount Barber's Matte Putty. Okay. With the matte putty, you get a nice easy spread, a small amount of shine, but not too much where it looks really greasy or oily. So you just use a small amount, like so. Rub it into the hand, but don't rub too much because you don't want to absorb the dirt and that off the hand or any elements. You don't want to rub the product into the hand too much. Okay? Place into the hair. Smooth through. And just maybe with a small round brush, just push back slightly, just on the front. So you just get a slight whiff effect. Your hair needs to be slightly longer than mine on the top just to get that smooth, sweaty look. Okay? Also with Gary Barlow's look, you'll see he's got a bit of designer stubble going on. Now for that what you need to do is maybe leave about two to three days worth of stubble and then get yourself a set of trimmers. Okay, so the trimmers, your barber can do this for you, and it's the best the best option to do is ask your barber to line it out first, because this is something what you can then follow at home with a shave. Okay, use the trimmers, and then set a line. So look at where the fold of your neck goes. So my fold of neck is here, so just set yourself a line going through there. Edge it round to the sides, and sharpen the side bits here. Okay. Also, be sure to trim just along the top lip here with the trimmers. This ensures no stubble goes onto the lips and you get a nice clean look. So to summarise, what we're doing is blow drying the hair to the side, lots and lots of volume going through the front to push back, nice short and sharp on the sides, number two, maybe one and a half, you want a really sharp look and then use Pound Mouth Barbers, Matt Putty, a small amount. Just break it through the hands and wipe through. If you have any questions about the look that we do today, please feel free to leave a comment below or visit us at www.poundmouthbarbers.com.